The preface of the study was to investigate the role of Cavillon 1 in breast carcinogenesis, and this is due to the conflicting reports of whether it's acting as a tumor suppressor or a proto-oncogene. And Cavillon 1 is the main structural component of cavioli, which are membrane uh, invaginations in the plasma membrane, which sequester um, signaling molecules like epidermal growth factor receptor, um, HRAS and SARC. So due to these interactions with signaling molecules, we investigated whether CAV1 positive breast cancers are significantly different from CAV1 negative breast cancers. What we found was that CAV1 positivity um, significantly associated with triple negative breast cancer status and that has been established before so we confirmed those results. So then we uh, focused our analysis on CAV1 positive triple negative breast cancers to CAV1 negative triple negative breast cancers to see if there's any differentiators between those two subgroups. And what we found was um, that uh, EGFR, epidermal growth factor receptor, was significantly um, upregulated in the CAV1 positive group um, by protein expression, so by IHC, as well as gene amplifications through uh, fluorescent in situ hybridization. Um, in addition, we saw overexpression of PDGFRA, which is also another uh, signaling molecule, the platelet de derived growth factor receptor alpha also involved in signal transduction pathways. Um, and we also saw higher levels of ERCC1, which is part of a DNA repair response pathway, and then TLE3, which is a surrogate marker for cells undergoing mitosis. Um, so those were the main significant findings that we found that have potential therapeutic importance.